Hey everyone, what's up? Welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Lena and in today's video, we are switching things up a bit. We are not doing a cash stuffing. Um, I'm just going to go over my little 2024 revamp as well as show showcase a bunch of happy mails that came in. But I do apologize in advance for the shadow. It is nighttime, um, almost 9 p.m. when I am filming this. But yeah, so let's get um, started into the video. So first, I want to show the new envelopes that I got from Katie over from the Fancy Dollar. Um, they are just the cursive vellum, matte vellum envelopes that I have in um, these or most of my binders, but I am switching the pink one out. And I also got some new A7 envelopes for my wallet. So let me switch out my wallet first because that's the easy one. And then the binders um, are probably going to get a little bit complicated. So let's see. I'm just gonna switch the money over. So personal, I do have prop money in here from Katie. So thank you so much. Um, if you guys want matte vellum envelopes, go to Katie because the quality is amazing and yeah, she's super fast. So Lena is going into personal. And then groceries is next. And comparing the two, these are round edges, which is very different, but I love it so much. And the font is a little bit bigger. So every once in a while, I like to switch things up. So this is the perfect time for the new year. So gas, miscellaneous, and then LJ, my son, is right here. Okay. So then I also have dollars, miscellaneous, and tips. So tips, I actually got the idea from Katie because I do always tip if I'm like getting food or even buying coffee, but I usually just take it out of the funds that, you know, in the, in the category, but I'm not going to do that anymore. I'm just going to budget for tips and then do that. Dollars is the rollover dollars. And then miscellaneous is, um, if I want to go shopping or, you know, whatever, and I have to pull from one of my envelopes, that's where miscellaneous comes in handy. Like if I'm going to get my nails done, I just pull from beauty and then it'll go into my miscellaneous envelope. So I'm going to say goodbye to these envelopes for now. And then these will be my new envelopes for my wallet. And I love them so much. So thank you again, Katie, for my envelopes. Um, let me take these out. She did include some extra prop money for me and extra stickers. Which are so cute. I love Hello Kitty so much. So let me just put these over here. All the Sanrio characters. Okay, so the pink binder here um, houses most of these categories that I switched over, but I do have some new ones like school supplies, um, LJ's birthday, my son's birthday. Um, those are new, but I'm actually going to switch everything in the pink into this new green binder. Oh, I forgot to show the little charms keychains that Kitty also sent to me. These are seashells and they are so, so, so cute. So I'm gonna put that here. All right, here, let me move the two new categories over and then, can you guys even see the keychains? I don't think you can. Okay, it is what it is. Okay, so food, <clears throat> and food doesn't have any money. Next is daycare, and <coughs> excuse me. I'm getting over my cold, so bear with me. I'll try not to cough or I'll just like edit out. And then next is household. Let's see. Yeah, this video is unplanned, <laughs> so it could be a hot mess, and I do apologize if it is. My son's necessities. Usually my cash stuffings are like kind of planned because you know you can plan the budget, um, the breakdown, all of that. Capone, next is Capone our dog. Look at this cute envelope. She put a paw print. This is so cute. Thank you so much, Katie. So Capone. P next is P.O. Box. So yeah, I am doing like a mini revamp, not like a whole revamp buffer 
just because I really do like my binders. So I'm gonna keep them and then I am gonna take out the black um, LD dupe binder. Beauty, where's Beauty? Beauty. Okay, next is date night. And date night, I'm actually gonna move into my tan binder, I think. So I'll keep date night over here. Um, clothing. Next is home decor. And then budgeting and stationery is empty. Next is gifts. Okay. Annual expenses. Next is electronics. YouTube. Taxes. Whoops. Okay, and miscellaneous. All right, so that is what the green binder is looking like, and I am loving it. I'm actually really loving this green, which is surprising. And um, when I did restock the binders, everyone was getting green as well. So I'm thinking about putting white. Did I do white? The white keychain in here? Or blue? I think I'll just do the white. Okay. All right, so that is everything for my green binder. So I'm actually going to use the pink binder, but I'm just taking out the envelopes in here. So I'm going to move these aside. And then I'm going to switch my um, family binder into this pink binder. All right, and let me put the keychain in here. I am thinking about putting um, my son's birthday and school supplies slash pictures in here as well, but I'll probably just put that at the end. Um, just cause I think it's like family related and why not? All right, so goodbye to this black LV dupe binder. You are so good to me. Um, if you guys want, maybe I could do like a giveaway if you guys don't mind that this is used. Let me know down below in the comments if you would want to do a giveaway for this and I can always do that. All right, so that is it for the pink binder. I just have to get used to that. My I have to get used to the fact that my family binder is now in my pink binder. But she is gorgeous and yeah. All right, so that is it for that one. For the tan binder, the only thing I'm switching in here is adding date night. And I think for this, I'm gonna put it right after family fun. So right here. Okay, so that's everything for this binder. And then for my saving challenge slash um, holiday binder, I'm not going to be switching much in here, but I did get a new um, Christmas envelope from TS Budgets, and this is what it looks like. It's so, so, so pretty. It does come with a saving challenge tracker. It's also matte, so I'm excited to use that. And, you know, I've never done like a matte um, saving challenge, so I'm just gonna put it in here. And then she was kind enough to give me a fully funded slip, and all of this came in, in like a goodie bag, like a dust bag, and the packaging was just so good i don't have it right now or else i would show you guys but let me just switch out the christmas envelope really quick okay 
Okay. And I'm going to keep the paper clip, I think. Can I? Yeah, that looks good. Okay. So yeah, this is still... Everything in here is going to stay the same because I'm finishing up the 100 envelope challenge. And then I haven't started these two challenges yet, but I will in, in a few days, which will be January, my $1 saving challenge. And then here are my holiday envelopes. These are all from Stuff and Budget. And this Christmas one is from TS Budget. And then I have um, a couple of trackers from Budget with Carly. So that is that, and it's so pretty. And speaking about um, Stuff and Budget, Candy was so kind enough to send me goodie mail or happy mail so let me show you the two happy mail really quick this is from candy um it was so unexpected but she did come out with the new lunar new year saving challenge and i absolutely loved it i was actually gonna purchase one um but she sent it to me and then this chase amigos tequila or tequila salt and lime um saving challenge tracker which is also so cute to scratch off and laminate it so you can reuse and also some stickers so she wrote me a little note i just won't read it because i like to read those off camera um and then one last heavy mail is from jess from budget with jess she sent me a christmas card as well as some saving challenges so thank you so much save 2024 dollars in 2024 i think i wanted to do this try to do it after the 100 envelope challenge so we'll see rainy day and then save 24 dollars in 2024 which I have a saving challenge already like this, and I'll show you guys in a second. And then mini saving challenge. So Jess, if you are watching, thank you so much. Thank you everyone. Like thank you Katie, thank you Candy, Jess. Um, thank you to TS Budgets and as well as Flo over from um Florence Flo over from Instagram. Um, I checked out her Etsy and these are so cute. So I did purchase the five dollar, ten dollar, and twenty dollar saving challenge, and they actually save you like. A good amount, a thousand, two thousand, and four thousand. So these are very ambitious goals. So we'll see. But yeah, I think I want to do the five dollar one because that one's probably um, pretty doable for me. All right. Last but not least, I just want to show you guys my saving challenge binder. I guess is what you called. This is just a black binder. The rings um, in this binder doesn't really close all the way, or like, like yeah, it just bothers me a little bit. So I just use it to store my saving challenges. But these are the ones that I haven't gotten to yet. So the um, Save um, 24 and 2024, which is very similar to Jess. I actually purchased this already from Cute Nini Things. And it's a tracker. So I will be incorporating this um, sometime next year. And then this is just a bookmark. This one, Save $1,000, is from Aya Plans. And I plan on using this as well. I have so many challenges, but like, where's the money? And then this one is from Candy. She gave me a couple freebie saving challenges. Um, a little while ago and I haven't done them yet so that's why they're in this binder for me to do one day and then this sushi saving challenge is from uh, Mystic Budget Smell over from Mystic Budgets and then I have a couple from Nancy over from Un Petit Budget the Christmas one cozy season save the bill and then I have this one from um, Lauren over from cosplay girl budgets $25 mini one so this one I will definitely try to do um, when I'm trying to finish my 100 envelope challenge and then this one was a freebie from Mel from Mystic Budgets the October one and then I have a couple mini saving challenge from TS Budgets and this one's from Budget with Carly which I'm probably gonna you know use next Christmas and then here are just some of my Christmas envelopes so I'm gonna add this one in here as well and yeah, I just store all of my saving challenges. So it's a bit much and you know, obviously you don't have to do this. You don't have to be like me because sometimes it's overwhelming. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna be adding all my new saving challenges that I received from everyone in here. So it could be in my, um, you know, little playlist as, you would call, as I would call it. But yeah, thank you so much. This is just amazing. And like I said, I'm so sorry about the lighting, all the shadow and stuff. I usually like to film during the daytime, but my son, LJ, and I have been home for the past um, two weeks. One, because he got sick, and then second, because it's also winter break. So yeah, it has been a long two weeks, let me say. But um, I am enjoying this time with him and, you know, just the slower pace of life. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoy this video. Maybe a little bit of a chaotic video, and I'm so sorry for that. 
but let me know what are some of your goals for 2024 could be financial or not um for me financial goal one of it is definitely to finish my 100 envelope challenge and that will go towards my emergency fund i am trying to reach 15,000 in my emergency fund by the end of 2024 so that would be one financial and then one non-financial is just being consistent with um working out and losing a couple pounds lbs you know um so yeah those are two of my goals let me know what uh, some of your goals are and thank you so much for hanging out with me tonight and if i don't catch you i'll talk to you in 2024 um so yeah i hope you guys enjoy the rest of your day your night your week your weekend whenever you're watching and i'll talk to you guys later bye